What's going on YouTube today? We are on part two of the 1000 subscriber celebration. I thank everybody for watching my channel and subscribing. It's amazing. Um, today I have a really awesome treat. We haven't done this in a long time. We're going to be organizing my, my collection here, my binders. This is stuff I've gotten over the past two and three months. This is stuff I bought off eBay, off um, uh, Facebook groups, single cards, all the stuff I've opened, uh, Rebel Clash and Darkness Ablaze stuff, all stacked in here. Um, stuff I've opened off camera. So we have to, stuff you saw in the last video, part one, uh, where we uh, opened up 40 packs. Like we, we made our own custom uh, booster box, plus we opened four more packs than that. It was insane. The pulls were awesome. Um, but we're going to organize these binders today. I already kind of have them laid out the way I want them. Um, I can't find any more black Ultra Pro sleeves. I've been to a couple different card shops. They don't have them, so I have to... Um, order some online. So we're not going to change these sleeves yet, just so I know which ones I have to swap out. So we're going to leave these sleeves on them. Um, of course, guys, for the video starts, hit the like button, hit that subscribe button. We're over a thousand subscribers. This is amazing. We are doing awesome. Um, I appreciate everybody. So let's get right into this here. So we are going to go through all this stuff here. We're going to kind of go through this and organize as we go. So let us Let's organize it first before we open up the binders. So we got, look at that. We got ourselves a um, Crystal Kingdra. So that's a colorless Pokemon. We got Gyarados's Water Psychic. You guys will kind of get an idea of how I um, organize my binder or my binders with this. You, if you guys have seen the videos before, I've done this before. Um, so I, I kind of sort everything by type. And I try to go in set order, but I really don't. I, I really, I really honestly have given up on set type uh, or, or set because it just doesn't end up working out because you trade one or two things and you have to like move the whole binder around, which is, which is crazy. But as you guys can see, we've gotten a lot of, a lot of hits recently. Got this really nice, this really nice Mew right here, which is awesome. From Expedition, I believe. Another Zoark. Vettel. Beldum. Oh, so Valley's colorless. You go up there. Snorlax colorless. Rhyperior's fighting. Let's look at that. Flareon Gold Star. Scooped up from a Facebook group that I'm a part of, which is awesome. Got it for a really good price. Uh, we got two Grim Snarls. And a lot of dark Pokemon. As you guys can see, the full art Crobat that we got from the um, stay at home pre release. Another Grim Snarl. Another Crobat. Look at all this stuff. Uh, colorless Salamence, Sonia Full Art. Look at the Ray Ray EX. Look at that Ray Ray EX promo card. Super awesome. Uh, we got Necrozma. The older stuff, though, we're not going to put in these GX and EX and uh, V binders. They're going to go somewhere else. So just bear with me as I organize. I'm hoping I get the organization properly. Look at this Toxtricity. Pinchurchin. Look at Olina. Rainbow Rare, we got Butterfree, Frost Moth Secret Rare, Rillaboom, Eldegoss, another Eldegoss, Full Art. It's crazy stuff. I haven't um, paid attention to actually playing the game in a, in, a, in a good long while, so I don't really know. Look at that Raikou. Raikou EX, uh, Rockets Raikou EX I, I picked up on the Dark Pokemon. And Full Art. Double... Charizard, uh, Dragapult, Dark Persian, Santa Scorch, Vika Volt. But yeah, I kind of figured you guys want to see where the collection is at this point. Um, it's a rotating collection. And I don't keep sets, and I don't, I don't, um, um, I don't like hold on to stuff. I'll things I like, I'll keep, and then I will trade a lot of stuff away. So let's let's move. Let's move this stuff to the side here. So we got our. I know this might this some of this stuff might be off camera, but it's just for organizational sake. And so this video is not seven seven and a half hours long, because um, I'm exact not ex entirely sure what um what binder we have in front of us here, meaning type wise. So we got. All right. So let's go. Let's go. Here we go. Here's our first binder here. So here's colorless. You guys can see I've gotten some of the Silvallies, the Full Art Silvalli. I traded for that one. Um, I like that. This is a pretty good card with disc reload. I wanted to get. I wanted to keep that one. 
Um, and I have the regular Sil Valley. You never know. Some sort of expanded or whatnot. Got a shiny EV. Uh, Oranguru, shiny. All right, so let's grab our colorless Pokemon here. So now we're gonna have to play. We're gonna play around here. So we got our shiny EV goes down here, and our double goes with the double. Now Ray, Ray, Ray is not going in spine. It's going in the vintage binder. So Ray's got to go to the side here. So we'll keep Ray to the side. Uh, Salamence, Snorlax. Do I have? Oh, I do have a Snorlax. So we'll take Snorlax V out for a second. Um, we'll pop this. Sil Valley there. That's the different one. I don't think I have the other one on the front page. I don't. So that's the other Sil Valley. Then I can put the Kingdra. Crystal Kingdra goes in the vintage binder. That's not even going in this, in this binder. We'll turn the page and we'll start sliding these in. That Salamence is super awesome. That's such a cool card. Shiny uh, Swablu is awesome too. Alright, so that goes. That's it for um, Colorless Pokemon. Now let's move over to Grass Pokemon, which we do have quite a bit. I know I have to separate the Rillabooms, because I already have a good portion of Rillabooms. you got Butterfreeze, two Pincers, all this stuff. is uh, The Shine Genesect, I believe, is supposed to go in the Vintage Binder, because I have all the Shiny Pokemon in there. So we'll put that to the side, too. We'll have to find a spot for him there. All right, and then let's grab... Let's see where we're at here. So we've got our... our Secret Rare Tapu Bulu, we got the Secret Rare Grass Energy, Scyther, Shiny Scyther, Rowlet, Dartrix. Cool stuff here. A couple of Prism cards. See, here's our Rillabooms and our Eldegosses. So we do have quite a bit. So let us take out the Eldegosses. Park, put, park them right there for a second. Let's get the Rillaboom. Let's get the two Rillabooms in. Uh, we're going... We go... Highest rarity town and lowest rarity, so full arts, regulars. Now we have the shiny leafy on, which can be our bridge here for this page, which it will be. So shiny leafy on will get parked right there. Awesome pull from the last video. That was an amazing pull. I can't believe I had um like two different or three different trainer full arts, um leafy on GX shiny and the Tapu Fini gold card all sitting behind um, my videos the last three months, not wanting to open up the... Uh, so we have our Eldegosses. How many... Where does our Eldegosses go? All right, so we have one full art Eldegoss, and we have three, four regular arts. So we'll go... We'll do this. We'll go Pinsir, Butter, uh, uh, Eldegoss, Butterfree. Actually, Eldegoss has got to go like this. All right, so let's go... Pinsir, Pinsir, Eldegoss Full Art, which is a nice card. Eldegoss, 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 Eldegoss. Eldegoss I can get rid of, and like the Pinsirs and the Butterfreeze, I'll end up trading them in at some point in the in the future, so I'm not even, I'm not even too worried about that. Um, and then that actually fills it for grass. We have no space left. Got the Mega Charizard Full Art. Evolutions, uh, Reverse Charizard, which is awesome. Shiny Reshiram, Victini, a couple of Charmeleons. We got, all right, so let's grab our Fire Pokemon here. What do we have? We have a, all right, Flareon Gold Star is amazingly gorgeous and goes into the Vintage Binder. So we have a couple of Charizards here. This is the one from Darkness Ablaze. This is the one. So we'll, what we'll do is we'll do this. Let's move... Let's move the Charizards out for a second. Move the Cinderaces down. Drop a Nine Tails and park that Full Art Nine Tails right here because I have two of them. We got two Full Art Nine Tails, and then what we'll do is let's go with the with the um, Hidden Fates Charizard. I think that's a good move, and then we'll. Um, Let's go, actually, okay, so I do have an extra Hidden Fates Charizard that's going to have to go at the back end here, which is fine. And then the Senna Scorch and the Charizard from Darkest Ablaze. All right, what do we got next? Ooh, water. So we got our Primal, uh, Primal Kyogre, which I got from my cousin, which I'm not trading. I love that card. I'll keep that in my collection. Got a couple of, couple of nice 
bangers in a row with the Gyarados GX, Palkia GX, Articuno GX, all rainbow hyper rares. Um, this Ash Greninja is from the first ever thing I opened on YouTube, the Ash Greninja EX box. Uh, we have so that's our water Pokemon. So we do have to, uh, we do have another gold Tapu Fini. How are we gonna play this? So let's take the Tapu Fini out. Let's park in there. Let's park the Mega Blastoise in there. I think that's fine. And then turn the page. Now I don't have to move anything on this page because we have everything. Oh uh, wait, where's Gyarados? We have Gyarados is here. Okay. Uh, so let's park. Let's move this Inteleon because we have a couple of Inteleons. Let's move that there. I believe we put a Gyarados there, and then we can slide in an Inteleon here, and then we have our Inteleon V Maxes, which is the Rainbow Hyper Rare and the full regular one. Then we have our. Th I'm gonna go three Secret Rare bangers in a row. We got uh, Tapu Fini, Tapu Fini, Frost Moth, and uh, the Water Pokemon. That looks nice. Electric Pokemon. We got a couple. We got the Tapu Cocos from when I had the deck back in the day. I'm gonna have a Dedenne here. Other ones are in my are in my deck. Uh, what do we got to move? We got some Bolt Hounds. What do we got to move? Toxicity. Uh, I do have a Toxicity V Max, so we have to move this whole page. Ah, okay. Let's move this whole page. Ooh. All right. So what we'll do is we'll take this. We'll take these out real quick. So we got our Toxicity. Let's pile up the other. VMAX Toxtricity here, uh, right there. So now we have our Toxtricities. Now we have more Picos. Uh, let's slide these in and we'll move the more Picos and we'll find something that I can pop in place here. Let's see. Um, let's go with. Well, we have the Raichus are there, so we're not going to use those. So what we'll do is put the Toxtricity there. We'll go Fika Vault, Pinchurchin. Then we'll turn the page for um, Raichu, Raichu, and then more Pico. So there we go. That looks okay. Like I said, I try to keep it with the sets going from oldest to newest, but after a while you really can't. I recommend going um, single page because um, the binder gets too thick and the cards that are on the ends here of, of the of the middle they start to they start to bend. So be careful. Just be careful. Alright next we got psychic Pokemon which I have only a couple. Uh, Mew is old. Mew is going into the classic binder, which is fine, or a vintage binder, whatever you want to call it. So let's see. You got Tapu. I got a Tapu Lele sitting here. I pulled that one. A couple of shinies, shiny uh, from the um, Hidden Fates, I believe Hidden Fates collection box, right? Am I right? Am I wrong? I think I'm right. And then Solgaleo and Lunala GX I pulled out of like random packs at the only game in town. Now here is our page of Dragapults, which is so close to being an entire page. Let's take out the Mewtwo and the Poltegeist. Park the Dragapult there. And let's put Pult, let's put uh, Giratina there. And now we have uh, Poltegeist going into Indeedee. We have Mewtwo and Necrozma, which <coughs> Necrozma is going to be um, traded in. I don't need Necrozma. I don't know. We'll see what happens with it. And I believe that is it for the first, first binder. Okay, first binder is done and ready to go. Let us grab binder two. See what goodies wait this one because I don't remember what I even have. Honestly, I haven't looked at this in a, in a couple months. All right, fighting Pokemon. So we only have one. We only have Rhyperior V, so this is not going to be very difficult. So let us get into that. We got two Lucarios. It's actually three shiny Lucarios, two GX versions. A couple of, uh, got a Buzzwall, a couple different shiny Buzzwalls. Shiny Sudowoodo got some Stone Jorners. Two Lichen Rocks. I got a lot of stuff. Mars Shadow, Sanaconda. I got two Sanacondas for Lynx. Rhyperior and his heavy rock artillery can be parked right there. 
So that's nice. See how I go by see how I go by type? Just drop an energy here and then just start going yeah, any way you really want. As you can see here, I, I like Lucario a lot, so I parked him I put him in the front. It looks nice. Uh, let's go to our next page, which is Steel Pokemon, which we have a couple of Steel Pokemon. Uh, let's see where we're at. So we do have a Beldum. All right, so we have a Beldum. So we had to figure the Beldum out. See what I mean? I think I said his last video. I got the, the uh, a Rainbow, a Hyper, a Full Art Regular of the Dust Mains, which is cool. Now, okay, let's see what we can do here. Let's... Uh, well, the Metagross is going to stay there, so let's take out all this. Look at that gold Zacian. Love that card. That's a good video to find. Find the first uh, box of Sword and Shield base that I opened because I pulled that and I lost my mind. Really lost my mind. So let's go Beldum here. Now, I saw Copper Rogers. Now, is he the same, are these the same Copper Rogers at a Mantine Press? Yes. So these will go here. And then we have... Genesect and Stunfisk, which will be Genesect. I'm not going to keep. He'll go. He'll get traded. In. His G Easy X. He's old. But let's go this, this, and then let's go Magnemite, Zacian, Solgaleo, Copperaja, 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 and then uh, Copperaja, Stunfisk, Genesect. So there we go. Our Steel Pokemon are ready to go, or Metal Pokemon, whatever you want to call them. I know Metal technically because of the uh, card game. Dark Pokemons, which we have the most of, I believe, at this point. So we got Ryko, Rockets Raikou EX is going to the Vintage Binder. What else is going? Nothing else is going. Okay, great. How many space do we have to work with here? That's the concern. I got six I got six spaces. Uh... Do, 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 do. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to double up a couple just because I'm going to trade some of those in. So we'll double up Sableye. We'll double up. Uh, what else am I going to double up? Well, let's park Zoark and Greninja here. That's fun. Park that there. Uh, we can leave those. Let's go Grim Snarl. Grim Snarl, Grim Snarl doubled. Actually, I don't want to double it though, because then I won't know unless I take them out. Because I'll forget. I will definitely forget. All right, I know what I'm gonna do. I know what I'm gonna do. Let's do this. Let's leave the Sableye. Let's put on this side what we're gonna get rid of. So I'm not gonna keep Persian. I'm not gonna keep this Zoar arc. I don't think Dark Eyes are gonna go. Um, and then probably the, the Yvettel is going to go too. So what we'll do is we'll park these, we'll put them over here so I remind myself that I actually have these cards as well to get rid of. And then we should be able to fit the rest here at the moment. So we got Grim Snarl, Grim Snarl, Grim Snarl, uh... Actually, I have four left. And what we'll do, we'll put a Grim Star on here. Those are just going to get traded. I don't need them. And then we'll go Zoroark, Zoroark, Greninja, Full Art, and then the two Probats. And that finishes up Dark Pokemon. Now, let's, let's take a look at some other stuff I have because I don't have any dragons to put in here. We got the uh, Plasma, Plasma something. Uh, I forgot which, which ones those are. Plasma Blast, I think both of those. I don't know. We got a bunch of Palkia, Dialga, which I love. Como OGX, Hyper, uh, Hyper Rare, I was trying to get when I was when we were going through the uh, Guardians Rising stuff. A couple of La Latios and Latias, uh, Prism Stars. Kirims, the Dragonite from the um, Shine Legend, uh, not Shine Legends, Dragon Majesty box. A couple of the Shiny Ray Rays, regular Ray Rays. Altaria. Now hold on. Was that Swablu? The Swablu we put in colorless. Was that actually colorless? Now I'm blanking because I remember I, we got a shiny Swablu. I think it was. I think it was colorless, which is weird. Uh, it was okay. So it's not. They're not going to go together, which is so weird. But it, it is what it is. 
that's their type, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna change it, you know, change anything. But we got ourselves Altaria here, of course. The line for Garchomp, which is awesome. This deck is fun to build, it's cheap. Even though it's not really in standard, you can you can find the Garchomp Lucario deck to build. It's really fun. I would recommend using it. And then of course we got the alternate art Latios and Latios making the heart, which is nice. Fairy Pokemon, I don't have very many. I do have some nice ones though. Um, I do have the alternate art Gardevoir Sylveon, Shiny Gardevoir, Shiny Sylveon. So I do have a decent amount of awesome fairies, but that's all I have is the one page. Then we got our secret rare cards. I got the Versus Seeker. I think it was at the, the one-year YouTube Versary. It's a long time ago, but I, got, I kept that one. Got a couple of trades here that I got for Trainers Mail. I traded Jirachis for this stuff. The Jirachi with the... Um, the one that puts itself to sleep. Look for a item card, I think, or a supporter or something. What is it? Whatever it does. I I, I forgot how to play the. I forgot how how the game works. How the cards what the cards do. Tag call a couple of great catchers. I mean, I have a decent amount of secret rares. I've traded a couple away too, but I usually try and keep them. Now I have a boatload of um of uh full art trainers, so we're gonna have to go through those now. As you can see, you got Skyla, Lysander, a couple Sycamores for when if he ever comes back. I got a Bridget. I think I had two. I traded one away. Both versions of Pokemon Fan Club. Uh, we got Bill, Steven, Blaine. We got the Copycat, which is nice. Pokemon Breeder from um, Shining Legends, I think. Could be totally wrong. Uh, Acerola was great in the Taco Coco deck. What are your favorite cards? What What's your favorite Full Art Trainer right now? I'm curious. Just let me know in the comments. That's something that I, I like to know because everybody seems to have their own ideas of what their what their favorite uh, Full Art Trainers are. Uh, let's see. So I have... I got Misty's favor. I pulled randomly one day. What a one pack. It was really funny. Look at this full force. I got a lot of stuff. All right. Let's put some more... Let's put some more in here. So we got ourselves N. It's getting, going in right here. Uh, we got... Let's go Fisherman, Aether Foundation, Employee. Then let's go Olina, Rainbow. And then uh, Double Sonia. And then that finishes the Trainers, which is awesome. And then let us close this binder after we look at the prisms real quick. I have the prisms in here. I always forget that I have them in here. But let's look at the prisms real quick, which are they're really nice. Um, I don't have all of them. I think I'm missing a couple. This was the one that was errored, and they never changed it. I was hoping they would change it, so these may become worth some money, but they never did it. They never did it. All right, so let's close this binder up. And now let us move on to the vintage binder, which I'm sure people will still like to see. A lot of stuff hasn't really changed, but there has been some additions. So let us go through it. As you can see, I put the shiny legend stuff in here, like the, the shiny Lugia Celebi, the Mew, Ray Ray. I got the Mew tube in the middle. Then I got some of the other ones over here. Um, the Jirachi Volcano, which is horribly miscut, which you guys I think I've seen before. Um, look at how horribly miscut he is. Look at that. Look how thick that is compared to the bottom. It's insane. It's really, really funny. But, um, so we got those, the double ho oh, is another Shining Ray. Now, we have our Shining Genesect. We don't really have a spot for him, so he's going to actually have to go in the, gra uh, the grass part of this. Um, but as you can see, I still have the first edition um, Shadowless Blastoise, which I really want to get graded. I want to get the Sweet Coon Star graded. Um, I like the Shining Lugia here from uh, Call of Legends, I think. Hollow Dark Blastoise, some uh, Palky level left, which is super awesome. This Shiny Kyogre, which is a little damaged, but I got I got it for a decent trade, so I, I picked it up. The Reverse Tentacruel is nice. I like those e-readers. Um, do we have any water to put in? Uh, no, we don't. All right. We have a Kingdra Prime, a couple different Kingdras, and obviously I got another Kingdra, as you guys saw earlier, the uh, Crystal Kingdra, which really I should get graded to go with that Lugia I keep in the background. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll consider that. I'm not sure yet. 
then we have a couple of the hollows from fire red leaf green here i had the blasters to go with them but i traded it for a bunch of stuff one time and i don't know why i did that but i did i traded them away which is okay sometimes you just do that um got a sweet coon from neo revelation uh, misty's garage which is a nice card so we're on to grass now as you guys can see uh base set venusaur scyther without the um the, the jungle logo, which is the misprint, uh, full uh, first edition Meganium, first edition Erica's Violetum, got this for like six bucks, and it's like perfect condition. There's a fire leaf green Venus Ariette, which is a gorgeous card, super super beautiful. Do we have any grass? Oh yeah, we do. We have the uh, Genesect to put in. Um, do you guys see? We got some e-readers parked over here. Needle Queen, Needle King together. Uh, Delta Species Snorlax, which is cool. Uh, first edition Bellowsome, double jump, uh, jump fluff, which I have. Uh, I pulled those myself. Pull, I got that myself out of the um, the starter deck. Uh, got that myself. All this myself. A lot of the stuff I got myself. Uh, then we have the, the triple Heracross, which I got myself. The both Shame and EXs. I mean level Xs from um, uh, Diamond and Pearl, Platinum set. I don't remember. I think it's Platinum. Could be wrong. Uh, let's put Genesect in here so he has a home. Now we're on to Fire. Of course, we have the Secret Rare Charizard from Stormfront. First edition Dark Charizard. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys see I do post some of these cards in here periodically on there and on, on Twitter. Follow me at Green Medieval. You guys will see all this cool stuff. Um, I'm just kind of showing you all in one bulk video today. Uh, we got Typhlosions, Rockets Moltres, the Nine Tails from Base Set, which is a nice card. Light Arcanine, which for some I didn't realize it was worth so much money, but it is now. Light Arcanine, I don't know. People love Light Light Arcanine. Got the Entei, uh, Shining Entei, or Shiny Entei, the promo card. Entei from the first movie promo card. Hollow Houndor, which is a great looking card. This is a really nice card. Hopefully it's not going to get messed up from the, uh, the lighting, but you guys can see how nice and hollow it is. It's a nice card. Uh, Entei, which is awesome. E-Reader Camera Up. I pulled this myself recently. I, I think I opened this on the channel. I think this came out of a pack I opened, if I'm not mistaken. It was, it was either the Volt Picture or the Camera Up. I don't remember. What do we get here? We got uh, Colorless, which... Do we have Colorless? Oh, we have to back up. Hold on. We have to back up. We got the we got the Flareon Gold Star. Let's park that Gold Star. Uh, let's put it here for now in the middle so it doesn't get bent. We'll figure it out. Figure out a better place for it later. But for now, Flareon Gold Star is going to go right there. We are now looking for colorless Pokemon because I got two of them. I got this, the Kingdra and I got the Ray, the Ray Ray EX. As you can see, I love Lugia. I got Lugia EX, uh, Genesis Lugia, uh, Dragonite from Fossil from Forever Ago, Hollow Dark Dragonite, Light Dragonite, uh, Ray Ray right here. Not the Shining one from Call of Legends, but the regular one. Still cool though. Uh, Salamence EX, Garchomp C Level X, which is cool. I had the regular Garchomp Level X. I don't know where I went. I think I guess I traded it. Um, and now let's park Ray EX here. He's going there. There you go. Ray EX there, and then let's put Kingdra, Crystal, Crystal Kingdra right in the middle there, just like we did the um, uh, the Flareon Gold Star, just so it doesn't get uh, damaged. Double cool Porygons. I believe one of them is still sealed. Yeah, I got one of them in a sleeve still sealed. That's right. Cool Porygon. What is he? He's cool. Hashtag cool in the comments for anybody who loves Porygon. Which he might be next month's Community Day. Which is going to be super baller. Uh, double um, double Mewtwo's. You can see one Shadowless Mewtwo. Uh, Shadow Shadow Mewtwo. Still fine. Perfect condition. Rockets Mewtwo uh, first edition, which needs to get graded. Got to send that out. That has got to get graded. Uh, we got Mew, Jirachi, Dark Alakazam, Slow King, Dark Hypno. Um, we have to put our Mew in this binder, in this section here somewhere. Uh, we got Sabrina's Alakazam. I got Crobat Prime, Espeon Delta Species, uh, Double Typhlosion Delta Species Psychic. It's really wild. Uh, Fossil Gengar. So we're going to put, just like we've done recently, we'll put Mew in the middle so it doesn't get, doesn't get bent up on either side. Keep it nice and flat in the middle. Espeon, that was a hard one to come by. Uh, that was a, that was quite a bit of money. And I think it's in pretty decent condition. Let's take a look. 
I got it from, where did I get it from? I got it, I think I got it from eBay so, at some point. I think it's in pretty decent shape. Yeah, it's in pretty, it's in, yeah, it's in pretty decent shape. It's got like a dot on the top, but whatever. I mean, if you're not going to grade it and you still like the cards and now everything's going up with, uh, you know, everything going on right now, vintage has gone up. Which is the coast that's gone up tremendously, which is insane. Oh, we got our reverse Pichu from uh, E-Reader, which is a gorgeous card. Surge's Magneton I pulled myself from one of the gym sets, which is epic. Dark Empress pulled myself. Uh, Surge's Electabuzz, which I didn't realize I even had, which is hilarious. I didn't realize I even had that card. I must have bought that more recently because I forgot about it. Uh, we got Secret Rare Electabuzz from Stormfront, I think. Uh, Delta Gyarados. Uh, Delta Fer Fer Alligator, The Delta Charizard, which is awesome. People kind of like that card. Happy I got one of those. Uh, we got double uh, the Delta um, Twins. Then we have uh, Dragonite Delta, which is awesome. I got two of those. And one's got the stamp. One's a reverse. One's a regular, which is awesome. I got an Arceus. One of the one of the Arceus and the ones you put together that make the that make the the, the swirls. I wish I had the others, but I don't. Uh, let's go to fighting now. We got ourselves our first edition, the Champ. Everybody and their grandmother has that card. Uh, Dark Dark Trio first edition, awesome card. <laughs> Him busting through the um the house into a room. I always love that card. Such a great design. Look at that, guys. Look at that. A evolution Pokemon with 50 HP. You never see that. You never see that these days. Isn't that insane? Just crazy. Dark Tyranitar. Uh, where's our regular Tyranitar? I thought we got another one somewhere too. I think maybe, maybe it's in the dark section. Double sh double secret Hitmonchan from Stormfront. I believe Stormfront. No. Uh. Something else. Let me know what which where is this from? I forgot where it's from. We got the Metal Energy Double Metal Energy Hollow, Secret Rare. I mean, uh, first edition Skarmory. I love Skarmory. As you can see, Skarmory and Steelix and Dialga kind of pile up the uh, the Metal Pokemon. I love I love those three. Oh my God, Metagross, Steelix, Magnezone. Dialga G Level X is awesome. Scizor, uh, 80 HP for an evolution is wild too. It's very low. Agron EX. Now our dark Pokemon where we can park our Rockets Raikou EX in there, which is really sweet. Hound Doom, which is a great looking Hound Doom card. Uh, Tyran there's our Tyranitar. That's not the the redo from um. What set was that in? I don't remember. Maybe it was uh, Shining Legends or something. One, one of those. Uh, Hound Doom. Listen, I got both of them, which is awesome. Dark Dragonite, that was from a starter deck. I believe I got that. Yeah, it's from a starter deck. Mighty Hina, a Delta Species. And I believe, yeah, after a couple of funny badges I got from, from League a long time ago, <laughs> League uh, Primarina, I uh, got an old school rare candy here from uh, 2005, Regice, League, and then I got the really hilarious Iwakumi, uh, Imakuni, um, you're active Pokemon's not confused. Hilarious card. And it's reverse. Very, very cool. But yeah, I figured you guys wanted to see the uh, collection update at this point. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys liked the video, hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button down below. We are going to have more Darkness of Blaze coming. Uh, we'll have mini Pokemart. Um, I'm pushing that video back. I already recorded it, but I'm pushing it back so we can do the 1,000 subscriber celebration. Also, part three and four of the 1,000 subscriber celebration is coming up. We're going to be doing um, Godzilla stuff. Uh, Godzilla toy reviews coming up in part three and part four. We got Battle Spirits and Magic the Gathering um, Godzilla uh, card collection reveals. I'll show them on uh, on video for the first time because I've only showed them when I've opened them. So, of course, guys, like I said, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. We're above a thousand subscribers now, so you guys are awesome. I appreciate you. And until next video, guys, take it easy. Peace.